Hello, I am Siddharth Pindharkar from Pindharkar Coaching Institute. Let us understand this sum. A student weighing 45 kg is running with a speed of 8 km per hour on a footpath 2 meter wide. A small car weighing 1200 kg is moving with a speed of 60 km per hour on a 20 meter wide road. Calculate their Dubroy wavelengths. So these are the numericals to calculate Dubroy wavelength. Just some information about us. Kindly check up our website pindharkarsinstitute.com for more videos and more information about us. We run online batches for teaching students of grade 11 and 12 for their board exams, as well as we coach them for their JWE, NE, TCET, etc. Kindly download our app, Pindarkar's Coaching Institute app for more than 2,500 videos on physics, chemistry, mathematics. Also, for more free videos, please check our YouTube channel, Siddharth Pindarkar. Coming back to this numerical, let us look at the student first. His mass is 45 kg, so M1 is 45 kg. His velocity is 8 km per hour, so 8 km per hour. I want to convert to meter per second. Kilometer to meter, multiply by 1000 into 1000. And R to second, one hour is 60 minutes and one minute is 60 seconds. So 60 into 60, which is 3600 seconds. Now please see, you can multiply by 1000 by 3600 or once you reduce it, it is 5 by 18. So kilometer per hour, two meter per second, multiply by five upon 18. And then mass of the student is 45 kg. Coming further to the car, mass of the car is 1200 kg M2. And its velocity is 60 kilometer per hour, which is 60 into five by 18 or 60 into 1000 by 3600 meter per second. And momenta of each, let us find momentum. As such, there is nothing like momentum. It's a man-made term by multiplying mass and velocity. So momentum P1 of student is uh, mass into velocity m1 v1 so 45 kg into 8 into 10 raised to 3 upon 3600 meter per second please write the units kg and meter per second so when you multiply it you will get 100 kg meter per second as the momentum of the student momentum of the car again m2 v2 1200 kg into 16 into 1000 by 3600 meter per second so which is 20,000 kg meter per second and the bro is wavelength please see the Broglie's wavelength is given by lambda equal to h upon p, which is h uh, is Planck's constant, p is momentum of that body. So lambda 1 for car, sorry, my mistake. This is the Broglie wavelength for student equal to h upon p1. p1 is momentum of student. h is Planck's constant, 6.63 into 10 raised to minus 34 joules second divided by 100 kg meter per second. Uh, please see joules second kg meter per second all are SI, so lambda will be in meters. So it comes out to 6.63 into 10 raised to minus 36 meters for the student. And similarly, lastly, the Broglie wavelength for car would be lambda 2 equal to h upon p2, 6.63 into 10 raised to minus 34 joules second h and momentum of the car 20,000 kg meter per second, which comes out to be 3.32 into 10 raised to minus 38 meters for the car.